Strike incoming. A friendly SATCOM active. A friendly SATCOM active. G'day guys, my name is Marty, aka Cryptic Existence, and before I get going, one of my mates, QWERTY, play with him all of the time. We just started this lobby, and I love this map, so I thought, uh, I'll join him next game. Um, it's really funny, I didn't even realise he joined the game, and he almost, oh my god, got so close to killing me on my chem strike. Um... I didn't even realize until the next lobby when we partied up, he, uh, <laughs> he, he's, um, he congratulated me on the cam and such, so it's kind of funny. Um, there he is joining as I'm jumping off into a really weird location, so I was paying too much attention to the map. But um, anyway, as I said, my name is Marty, aka Cryptic Existence, and I want to bring you today my first cam. So, it is a little bit campy. I won't claim to be you know fear crads or um someone from feed by all dropping freaking two minute cams no that's not me um but i really 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 wanted to hit one um i was playing um for a few hours this day um really started getting used to this ak-12 i absolutely love it but as soon as i got this cam i've moved on to my next weapon i want to try and bring a few cams with a few different weapons and a few different maps and ultimately just give you guys some variety so of course i hope you like and if you do please hit like now um i don't know too much more about the class because i did cut most of the game out and i missed the start so uh, you can see the perks loading up on the right and such so yeah i wanted to um talk about today uh something Look, it was it was kind of amusing. Um, it, it happened to me about a week ago, maybe a week and a half ago now. Uh, I didn't quite realise. Well, my my car was doing some stupid things, and um, I, I drive a I drive a Holden. Um, for those in Australia, you will know exactly what one of those are because they're everywhere. But for all of you in the states, I think they also go by the Chevys and such. There. Um, now. Yeah, recently it have been doing stupid things like the like, when, when you go to start the car and you move it out of park into neutral or or drive, I suppose, because it is an auto. I used to drive manuals and they're amazing. I love driving a manual and it's really good in a little sports car and things. I used to drive a Prelude, which I still want to do a video about, so I will get around to that one day. Um, but yeah, uh, I drive in a lot of traffic, so I drive an auto. So it wouldn't shift out of park. It'll get stuck, so you have to hit that little... Uh, the, the, there's like this little area where you can drop down a key, or in my case, I had a really small screwdriver that I was dropping down there so that it would let me get out of park. Uh, things stopped working, and, and I knew what this kind of meant. It was always going to be that brake switch uh, because ultimately my brakes were working fine, but the car just didn't know I was pushing them uh, in, in an electrical circuit that requires knowing that such as release out of park you know that's kind of important so anyway one day i then realized that i had no brake lights and this starts to become a little bit more of a problem when you drive for two hours every day in city traffic in melbourne traffic gets pretty hideous at about far out probably about 7 30 in the morning i leave well i don't know i'm i'm out of the door well before that i'm out of the door by about by about seven and you know by the time i start getting into the inner city uh even just the roads just outside my place they start getting really bad about that time so by the time i get into the city and things i've already been driving for an hour and then when i finish work at i don't know if i choose to finish at four or whether i finish at five it's pretty hideous so when you don't have brake lights and there's cars just everywhere um it's not great because you know if you slam on your brakes because an idiot in front of you does something stupid yeah that, that's probably going to be a problem when they can't see that you're braking so i went through the car did everything i went through the fuses no nah. in the back of my mind the whole time i knew it was probably the brake switch i went through the fuses i went through the bulbs um i changed some little bulbs because i had a thing a little while ago where 
the reason it wouldn't shift out of park was because one of my little parkers was blown and it shorted that circuit and then the whole circuit wasn't picking up that I was hitting brakes. How stupid is that? Like the parker on your headlights, that's blown so you have no brake lights. That's just ridiculous. The worst, worst engineering of a circuit that I've ever heard of. But moving on. Um, I realized that it was that brake switch, but I couldn't get the part for about three days. So for three days, I was driving along, and I thought, far out, how the hell, how the hell am I, A, not going to get caught, and B, um, not going to get done uh, by the cops or by someone rear-ending me? Look at this satcom, save my life. Hello, oh, it's Quiddy. So I dropped my cam on him and die immediately. Shit, that was close. And then he leaves and everyone else leaves. But um, as I was saying, yes, uh, everywhere I had to brake, I was having to put my lights on so that my brake lights would light up. You know, when you put your lights on at night, your back lights turn on. That was a very, very long three days. So guys, I hope you enjoyed uh, enjoyed the cam and such. If you hit like, I really appreciate it. If you're new here, subscribe. Check out my previous video. I'm giving away a epi uh, a video a, a game of COD Ghosts for PS3. Cheers, guys. Take care.